Vou ver se eu quero fazer um novo vídeo. Uhum. Bora ver. Bodas, bodas game. Achei um novo vídeo. Como é que eu encontrei aqui o vídeo? Vou aumentar o nosso som no nosso computador. E bora assistir. What's up guys, it's the Cobra this here, and we have another episode of the Jack and Daxter HD Collection Let's Play. So let's head over here, let's see what we got. And Pekka is flying in the air, Shirk's area. Now, this is a really cool area for a specific reason, which I'm going to tell you guys. We're going to have to wait for that in a minute, and we have to resupply some ammo here, we don't. Check it. It looks like some kind of old eco mine. When Mar out these old caves to get at the eco power. Sheesh! That Ma guy must have never slept much. I'm going ahead to tell Onan we're back. Watch your tail feathers, Jack. This is a spooky place. All right, now, Mar built this entire thing. I'm not sure if it was by himself. I think it probably was. But... That must mean that guy must have been super powerful or something to get all that energy to knock this place into kingdom come and open up this entire path really so yeah that tells you a bit about the guy he built haven city he built the wall around it. he was really smart hiding the the, the last precursor stone from, from leader and also doing all of this he built ha haven city and every foundation from scratch I'm not saying that he didn't get the idea for or something but he probably thought about it all the time and this was an elevator. That right there looks like the Chain of Olympus. I'm just saying. I just realized that too. That looks like the Chain of Olympus from God of War 3. And let's see what we got. Oh, well, let's get out of here. Let's just get out of here. This is a really cool sequence that's coming up just now. And with this reflex rifle, this is going to make this challenge so much more easier. Get rid of these guys. This should be in Haven City. What are you doing here? These are actually the first metalheads we ever saw. And for some reason, in this copy, well, uh, in certain copies of the game, uh, originally in the Jack 2 cutscenes, there was one where Core was supposed to have a black inked face. But if you went to the, 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 the movie viewer like I did, it wouldn't show up. Now, the metalheads in Jack 2 had a lighter skin color or metal plating on them, while in this game it's what it's supposed to be. So I, I found that really cool. So it was more silver in Jack 2, and this game is more uh, rustish. And there's some new types of metal heads that don't even drop metal head gems, which is kind of weird. And I gotta shoot these guys out. And follow the yellow big road. Now let's head over here, and more of these. Now, this is where the glowing effect. Jack to these type of things were added to the engine those type of uh, railings are what they uh, primarily changed the engine for as for as you saw some of the glowing effects really come out signs and stuff like that too but that's where you can actually see it I got mentioned that during the Jack 2 let's play I'm not really even sure shoot this out of the way and uh die everything die There we go. This is an elevator. Why do things just keep popping out of the floor? I mean, I've seen a lot of gems just fall right through them. Wow, this one lit up. That's nice. A lot of things just fall right through the floor, which is pretty glitchy. I mean, is this my copy, or is that happening for everybody? Uh-oh. Getting some... Wait, why did I need that if I wasn't... 
part's kind of sketchy. Let's kill all these things. I know what's going to happen here, but... Seventeen died. Get out of my way. Come on. Anything survive that? Oh, no. Now you want to kill this thing and... There we go. Just smack him in there. I don't know if Mars set this up for those guys to, like, constantly run through this because they have a dispenser there and then that thing is running for, like, the rest of its life. <laughs> Seriously? That's how far Mar went. He didn't have electrical power and... <laughs> it's kind of funny. At the same time, it's messed up for these guys. And I think you can actually kill them by accident, but you don't want to. Because I remember when I first saw them, I started shooting the crap out of them. And that's not what you want to do. Oh, by the way, guys. Uh, did you guys see America's Got Talent? I, I know a lot of you guys are from the UK and stuff, but for my American subscribers, do you guys watch America's Got Talent? Because I saw this particular act where this guy was playing this, this string instrument across the entire theater. And I thought it was pretty epic, like the music from it. I just wanted to know your thoughts on that if you guys actually watch the show, but um, I know it's kind of weird. <laughs> Let's knock this one in here. Come on. You stupid, you fat rat. It, it fell in. That didn't make sense at all. Now these drills, what are they drilling? They're just, they were here for decades, maybe even longer than that. Doing absolutely nothing, and I think I'm dead. Oh, I'm not dead, I'm not dead, I'm, I'm good, I'm good. We're good, we're good, we're good. We're good. Everything died. Come on. Come out of the dispenser and just... There we go. This is why I hate. They're hostile and they're annoying. And I don't want to kill you guys, but... <laughs> I killed one. That was pretty mean, Jeff. Why'd you do that? Well, Billy Bob, I just had to done hit that dundee -dun 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 right into that contraption and it would set it off. Hey yo, my name is Tyrone. Gonna shoot all these uh these damn critters out here. So uh let's get rid of these, these metal heads. one up top. I don't know. What are these? These are like the evolved. These are the evolved form of the goobers. Get up here. Get up here. Stop being a little. Come on. You're dead. He's dead. Oh no. I like how they get knocked out after one hit. That's how Brolic Jack is. He kills these things in one hit. This one actually came all the way up here. Now I'm hoping this doesn't kill him. Yeah, because that would be really messed up to get in there. <laughs> messed up, but it has to be done, guys. It really does. All right, this is the epic part. What? That's the precursor object. Oh, yep. <laughs> to walk away from that are you serious explore okay now that means more knew we were coming here and he left that for us I, I'm pretty sure that's what it means. Or somebody left it for us, which is kind of sad because if, if they knew that we were coming, that's pretty cool, I guess. Now we have to hit all of these, these beams. Let me get this ammo first. These beams, these uh, tracks to lower the target railing. Now, with the reflector beam, all you have to do is like a wave of this and it'll actually travel down the entire thing and uh, lock onto it because it always has aim assist in every type of game that has a gun. They have aim assist. Now, with the aim assist, it actually acts as like a magnet towards most of the um, the objects. And with this, it's just gonna become a laser rifle because that's how effective it is. As long as you know where you're going, you should be good. Whoa, that's not good. Force field is up. Oh, let's head over here. Just making sure that 
thing I hit. And I just hit something else. That's nice. Come on. And you don't even really need to wait for the cart. I believe if you get every single one of these track items, they'll pretty much just let you continue onward with the game. So this is a really good way to go about it. There we go, more jetboard stuff. Here we go. And I like in this game how they added the turbo jetboard feature. It's a secret in the, um, the secrets menu.